Oh, good afternoon. I'm here with Kim Heike from Lynnhurst High School. Good afternoon, Kim. Hi, Leah. How's it going? It's great. So Kim and I go way back as soccer players from Bergen County, and Kim is a legendary soccer player from Lynnhurst, back at her alma mater. So thank you so much for representing your, your district. I can't think of anybody else to do it. <laughs> Um, Thank you so much for the kind words, Leah. You weren't so bad yourself. Oh, you and Kim back in the day. Back one <laughs> That's for another video. <laughs> All right, so Kim, yeah. what do you teach? Um, I teach high school special ed. We call it functional academics. It's a life skills based program at the high school. Awesome. And how long have you been at Lynnhurst for as a teacher? I've been teaching for this was my twelfth year, um, and I've been coaching for for ten years there. Great. Awesome. So you were talking about like community involvement with your, your students. Talk a little bit about that and that dynamic in Lynnhurst. Yeah. So I have in my class ninth through 12th graders. So according to law, the ninth and the 10th graders, if they're younger than 16, they can't go out to work. So usually how we streamline it is we, we try to keep it to the 11th and the 12th graders where in the afternoons, their afternoon involves them going to work um, in a place, hopefully, that we can connect to their interests and their abilities. Um, a lot of times, the kids enjoy TJ Maxx. We, we have a good relationship with TJ Maxx in town. We have a good relationship with Home Goods. We've had kids work at, we have like an an animal shelter type place, cool, yeah. a habitat for humanity type place. Not well, not the buildings, but yeah, yeah, they yeah. take in bats, they take in animals that don't have anywhere yeah. else to go. Yeah. So some of our kids that want to have a pet like um, job, we can't always work at PetSmart. We have a PetSmart in town, but some law legal issues, we can't necessarily yeah. work there. Um, so we have the hum humane society. That's yeah, what it's called. Humane society. Okay. Um, they work there. And then if the kids that aren't working, the, the ninth and the 10th graders, for those kids to get them out into the community, we will take trips within some, usually we stay in Lyndhurst, um, but sometimes we go over the bridge to Nutley, yeah. it's a Clifton, and we'll go to Target, oh. and they'll have a scavenger hunt where they have items, and they have to find the item, and then they oh. have to find the price, or sometimes we'll give them an allowance because we actually have funds for this program. Oh, wow. We raise our own funds wow. and they can spend and buy what they want to buy and teach them like, well, you know, if you have 10 bucks and you want X, Y, and yeah. Z, can you afford? Yeah. And do you need X, Y, and Z? Right, right, right. Um, I feel like life I think, skills. So, yeah. yeah. Teach, them handling money, money skills, it's, it's a big concept because they don't always know the change, how much change they should be getting yeah. back. And we don't want them to get taken advantage of. So we work yeah. a lot with money right. and getting them to understand as much as possible, you know, border, you know, how much should I yeah. get back? Kind of, you know, just yeah, so they yeah, have yeah. an estimation so they yeah. know it's close at least if it's not exact. Nowadays we teach them to, everybody's got debit cards. Yeah. Um, so handling the money isn't as it was maybe – 10 or 15 years sure, ago. Sure, sure. Um, so, like, we're out and about in the afternoons all the time. That's awesome. Um, I try to get them out as much as possible. You're out of your um, classroom, yeah. The mornings are dedicated to the academic end of it. That's great. So whether it's, like, working out in the real world or exp have doing these life experience things out in the real world, your focus and your program is really to prepare kids for, like, life after high school. Right. Yeah. yeah. Because our kids are not going to be going to college. So we right. have to make them as independent as possible. So their parents can relax a little bit because it's hard on them too. Like, what if I'm not around? I want my kid to, I want to know that my child's going to be yeah. able to take care of them. Yeah. That's so we great. try to lend those skills to and, them as best. Yeah, there's nothing more important. That's, that's amazing. Well, thank you for sharing more about this program at Lynnhurst and uh, listen to, to Lynnhurst High School. Yes, Thank yes. You. I owe Thank you a cup you of coffee. So